message on their behalf and at their embassy. We want uh, the U.S. government to compensate for the victims of 1998 bomb blasts. Compensation for the victims was championed for by different leaders, with the Senate ad hoc committee promising to seek justice on behalf of those affected. I'm more aware about the Kenyan case. And I've been reflecting this morning and asking, what could we have done better as a country, as government, because there was a period I was in government, what could we have done better to expedite compensation for the victims? What could the U.S. government have done better? Yes, we are friends. What could we have done as friends to ensure that there is closure for the victims? Hawa wa Kenya pia mungewaweka kama wana Kenya kwanza to stand with them, to keep working with the American government to ensure that justice is done and compensation is received. And even as we go into the future, we want to urge the American government. As our partners, let us continue strengthening our partnership in the war against terror. The Senate is currently probing plans laid to compensate the victims, have assured victims to be endlessly working to ensure the justice they seek is served. Through the, the U.S. Victim of State Sponsored Terrorist Act, we request consideration to make Kenyan victims eligible to, the, to participate in the U.S. Victim Terrorist Compensation Fund. Victims and survivors of the bomb blast attack that took place 25 years ago have gathered here today for memorial service here at the Memorial Park in remembering the loved ones, asking the government of Kenya and the U.S. government to come in terms for compensating the loved ones. Mevin Getembe, Look Up TV, Nairobi.